Hello guys, welcome you all in a new video and this video is totally dedicated to for those customers who are using Samsung Android as smartphone and you have locked your smartphone. I mean to say if your phone is locked due to forgotten pin pattern and password lock and uh, you're facing problem to uh, operate your smartphone and you want to visit service center to unlock your smartphone. So don't worry at all here. I will show you how you can unlock your smartphone without visiting any service center and without any data loss here but firstly uh, you will have to keep your phone on uh, samsung android is, and smartphone on hard reset mode after that when you will switch on your smartphone you will come on this phase one more thing i would like to tell you my friend that this method is applicable for any series of samsung android smartphone like a series f series s series and m series any kind of series can be unlocked with the help of this method so be with us at the end of this video then after you will be able to unlock your smartphone when you uh, switch your phones to the hard reset mode after when you will call, come on this page let's check what happens here firstly you will have to click on this start button and you will have to select all this option and go to the agree more and agree here let's check what happened after uh, this page when you click on this page, it will take some time to reach to the next page here. Now you can see here after hard reset, it's again asking here your pattern lock, but you have uh, you don't have remember your pattern lock, so don't worry at all. You will have to click on this use my Gmail account. Simply you will have to click on this Gmail account option. When you will click on Gmail account option here, it will ask your Gmail account and your password or your phone number with the help of password. You can unlock your smartphone with. Uh, on this page if you have remember your gmail id and password but if you don't have remember your gmail id and password so you can't bypass this phase okay so here i will show you how uh, how you can bypass this phase with some tips and tricks here okay as what i'm going to give you after this okay so by that trick you can get an skip option on this page to uh, bypass frp here okay now when you uh, get this option simply you don't have to do anything simply you will have to go to the back button here simply again you will have to go to the back button and you will have to reach to the uh, start page that's welcome page okay now here you will get an option of uh, language option simply you will have to click on this language option and you will have to uh, select the english uk here and uh, click on this ok option now after this you will get an option of emergency call you can see here simply you will have to click on this emergency call option now here you will have to dial some ussd codes that ussd code is star has zero star has when you will feed this ussd code star has zero star has you will reach to this space here you will get a lots of option here but uh, in this space you will have to use two options the first option is a version and the second option is sensor simply you will have to click on this version option and when you will click on this version option you will get some versions code here simply you don't have to do anything simply you will have to hold this space for five seconds and when the five second completes simply you will have to click on this back button now the second option is showing here sensor option so simply you will have to click on this sensor option when you will click on this sensor option you will get some synchronizing uh, option here so you don't have to do anything simply you will have to wait for some seconds to synchronize this after that you will have to go to the back button and you will have to click on back option now after again you will have to click on back to reach to the start page okay now after this you will have to click on this start option here now here you will have to check all these options continuously now again you will have to here you will have to take some action i mean to say here you will have to switch on your phone's talkback option and for this you will have to press the power button and the volume up button at the same time for the five second and release here to switch on your talkback option on your samsung android smartphone so press the hold sorry both the button you will have to press the same time power button and the volume up button for the five second one two three four and five and release here now when you will release here your phone stock back option will be uh, come on your page now after this simply you will have to draw a opposite l here now after that you will get an option of use come uh, voice command here okay simply you will have to click on this use uh, click double tap on view use voice command okay when you will click on this double tap now here you will have to google assistant google assistance navigation bar back 
here it's not working no, again i will have to switch off here this Talk back off. again you will have to switch on this Now draw the opposite Here's L. Commands to control talk back. Here are some things mm. that you can say. Copy. Read from next item. Find Here you will have to tap Speak on this faster. use voice command. Use voice commands. Google Assistant. Open setting. Now, when your phone Samsung phone setting option will be appear on your phone's display, simply you will have to switch off the talkback option with the help of power button and the volume up button. Yeah. Now, here you will have to make some changes on this page. Here you will get a lots of uh, option here. Simply you will have to change some settings here. Firstly, you will have to go to the option of. Uh, lock screen option okay here you can see here you will have to select this swipe option it will uh, already show here okay now here you will have to do some changes simply you will have to click on this face recognition option here you will have to continue on click three times continue again continue and again continue now after this you will have to go to the back option again you will have to go to the back option here now here you will get an option of privacy here Okay, simply you will have to make some changes on this space. You will have to uh, allow this clipboard access option. And again, you will have to go to the back option. Now here you will get an advanced feature uh, and you will get some options here. Let me check here. No, you don't have to change here anything. Now here you will get an option of general setting. You can see here the language is showing here uh, English UK. You will have to, you don't have to change anything here. Here you will have to uh, make some changes here. Simply you will have to change here the language and you will have to change the language to English UK here and switch off this English India. Now again you will have to go to the back here. Now, now, now let's uh, let some checks anything else. No, you don't have to do anything here. Now after this you will have to go to the back option. Okay, now again you will have to go to the back you will get an option of accessibility simply you will have to click on this and uh, click on this option allow this option now you will get this here so you will have to off this now again you will have to go to the back option again back option now again you will have to go to the back and close here now you will reach to this page okay now after this you will have to go to the agree option now here you will get uh, uh, an option of add network simply you will have to click on this add option you will have to type here SKI, skip sorry um you will have to here type b y p a w s bypass and the second one will be F R and P. Okay. You will have to type here bypass. Then the second would be F R P Samsung. You will have to key uh, press on this save option. Now you will have to go to the next option here. You will have to click on this one. You will get an option of setting. Simply you will have to click here. Now here you will have to uh, go to the option of reset to default setting simply you will have to click on this and reset keyboard setting erase personalized predictions and go to the back here again you will have to go to back now again you will have to go to the next option here you will get this page simply you will have to click on this don't copy option now after some changes you can see here you are getting here a skip option on this page where the gmail id and the phone number was asking here you, you will get a skip option here you can see here now here if you don't have remember your gmail id and password simply you can skip this uh, page and uh, you can go through to the go through to the unlock your smartphone so simply you will have to click on this skip option again skip here 
now go to the accept if uh, you want to use new pin pattern and password here you may uh, use new pin pattern and password on this page uh, one more thing I would like to tell you if you uh, if you have unlocked your smartphone so within one hour you will have to use new pin pattern or password otherwise your previous pin pattern or password will be activated again on your smartphone and smartphone and you will have to try this uh, method again so right now I am going to skip here uh, after some time I will uh, use new pin pattern and password okay skip here go to the ok next skip this option skip here now you will get a pop-up of up your all setup and you will have to click on this finish option because your all the setup has been finished here now you will have to click on this agree option you will have to select your language and next continue you will have to select your gender your age criteria now go to the continue and finish and finally finish now you can see here your samsung android smartphone has been unlocked like this okay and if your samsung android smartphone is locked with the help of this video then do the like this video you can see here my phones all the application which were in my smartphone as it is showing here in my smartphone you can see here okay so this is very useful uh, for those customers who don't want to lose their smartphone data so Thank you so much. See you in the next video with the next uh, technical tips. Thank you so much.